everyone! Today, I'll be showing you my springtail culture from Josh's Frogs. This is a temperate springtail. I don't know how to pronounce that culture. These are my first springtails ever. I seem to get a lot of springtails, but only for a few bucks. Which is pretty nice. It's only a few bucks. Seems to be a good amount in here. I've had them brewers used Trying to show you them, they're just very small. If you don't know what springtails are, they are great in bioactive enclosures and they're really tiny, but not technically insects. They do have six legs. Somehow not insects. They're really small. They move around like it's complicated the way they move around it's very hard to explain once they breathe a little bit more i'll put them in my isopod enclosures josh's frog shipped them great so um i think you should buy your spring fails from josh's frogs i bought them at amazon they were Less than twenty, less than forty dollars for a good amount of springtails. Also, I got this new creature's food, which is food for pet invertebrates. As you can see, here it is. Oh, there's a dent in it. That's fine. Springtails cannot climb walls. You can see, it's at joshesfrogs.com. Well, also, be looking. Got my Madagascar hissing cockroaches today. Okay, so here are my Madagascar hissing cockroaches. I'm not munching on it yet. Here's one. She's a very large girl. Female Madagascar hissing cockroach. Come on, you wanna go? As you can see, hissing cockroaches are awesome with handling. And they're also huge. Luckily, she didn't go into that water. I would have saved her, though, if she did. This is my colony. Let's spray it a little bit more. Springtails are also cleaned up crews in bioactive and isopod en and just isopod enclosures. I sprayed it already really recently, but I don't know if I did it enough. Here's my new spray bottle. They do live in the rainforest, so it rains much of the time. They're fine with droughts, I just like to spray them twice a day. So be careful. <laughs> Goodbye, everyone. If you want more updates on my springtail culture, just comment below and I will give you some updates and I will put them in an isopod enclosure soon, maybe. A little rapashy. Also, as a hidden secret at the end of this video, I had a poll on Patreon. What is the mystery pet for this? Also, congratulations for some new for the new Patreons, Marsha, Marsha, my new Patreon. Thank you, Marsha, for being my Patreon. Fight this fruit fly culture. I wonder what's there for. Take the poll and become a Patreon for as little as one dollar a month to find out. Betty, bye, everyone. See you in the next one.